Unknown Nine Awakening, or as I <laughs> prefer to call it, Unplayed Zero Awakening. Um, this won't actually take very long, no. as it appears, first of all, that the player counts declined by over 40% in the first week. Um, Reflector <laughs> Entertainment and Bandai Namco's Unknown with. Nine Awakening, which was developed by Sweet Baby Inc., has already seen its peak player counts decline by over 40% in its first week on Steam. Now, I don't know how, how many people here, probably a lot of them, watched Hypno play in this um, wretched-ass freaking game. It looks worse than Heavenly Sword. Now, Heavenly mm -hmm. Sword was a PS3 first wave release. It came out with the console... And it was basically a glorified tech demo. It was only about six hours long. So is this game. This game looks like late PS2, mm. like Final Fantasy 12 graphics. It's no better than that. Uh, it looks worse than Heavenly Sword, though. It's embarrassing how bad this game is. And um, when it first came out, as I reported, it had 285 concurrent players as its all time peak. Now that is two less. Than Tales of Kinzera, Zow. Right. So that's really terrible. Yeah. Really terrible. And what Appalling. happened? And and what happened to Abu Bakar's company as a result? It collapsed. Disappeared. So hopefully, yeah. Hopefully, history repeats. Huh? Truth is reality based. It's called pattern recognition. Yep. Absolutely. Um, I'm gonna just do a quick search here to see how it's doing and uh, get that up on the screen for everybody to I have a look cannot, at. I cannot wait for Unknown 9 to have nine players. Well, it's on 85 right now. Um, but it had actually dropped down to 59. But uh, actually, yeah, it's it's 24-hour peak is 123. Yeah. So that's actually I would imagine, uh, by the time it gets to to the end of the first month, it will be down to probably single digit numbers. Yeah. Based on um, the article that we were referring to at that point, the 24 hour peak was 166. So it's actually even worse now, <laughs> less than half, more like 60 percent at this point. Yeah. Pretty abysmal. Pretty bloody abysmal. Uh, that's all I can say about that. Um, but that's not all, of course, folks, because uh, Smash JT had a little scoop the other day, um, which was about how uh, nobody was playing the damn game. Um, nobody was buying the bloody game. Now, IGN obviously, it didn't even IGN, give it a seven. No, I only got a five. That's right. Yeah. It and so for IGN to level. even go and do that, you know, like they're notorious for giving uh, seven as the new baseline. Yep. Um, back, I think it was, yeah, Stuttering Craig said that his retail insider who has access to the 800 big box stores tell him that Unknown Nine Awakening had a total of 46 pre orders, but 12 were canceled. So actually, there were only 34 physical copies sold from eight. 100 stores. Uh, Alyssa McCunte decided to uh, chime in and say the Christo fascist blog citing an aging YouTuber who lost all his old colleagues and friends because he's a dick and claims he has Best Buy insiders as a source for their latest article. That's not at all what happened to Craig. Alyssa is a cunt. Anyway, um, <laughs> Christo fascist? Like, is she trying to make a Well, I mean, I think she's trying to take crypto fascist and turn it mm -hmm. into something else, but she can go right, sit right, on a fat right, one. Right. Well, you know, please fornicate yourself with the biggest, fattest cactus you can find, Ms. <laughs> when, 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 when uh, devising new words, you got to keep it light, keep it snappy, which is why, you know, I coined the term slunt, which oh. again. Slunt. I like that. I need yeah, that. Yeah. I yeah. need that. I'm, I'm taking that. Thank you. By all means, I, I want everybody. It's far and wide, and and uh, you know, I think that uh, it's the best label to uh, describe, uh, you know, pronouns. Macanta, yeah, is a complete slunt. Yeah, um, I you will find me using that in a video very soon. You Indeed, will. by all means, sir, you're it. welcome to it, sir. Thank you. Um, I do take the occasional gems from the chat and my colleagues, so there you go. Um, but I will, of course, always shout you out for it. Anyway, 
Uh, there's Alyssa McCante getting roasted again by Smash JT. But where are we? There's another article I need to find uh, that is about how somebody emailed Smash JT talking about how nobody had actually bought a single physical copy of Unknown Nine. <laughs> I mean, it's 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 pretty incredible, actually. I think it was, yeah, it was Smash JT, I think, yeah. Um, I'm trying to find it now. I can't find it. Where is it? Uh, God damn, where has that gone? He's dis made it disappear. Oh, well. No bloody copies were sold of... Uh, of unknown nine in retail stores according to smash jt and i don't know where the hell my uh article's gone it's fucking vanished hang on a second see if i can find it yeah. do, 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 do. but yeah so i mean this game is, is unsold a inventory mm. oh beautiful yeah <laughs> unsold zero even better <laughs> god damn that is really bad isn't it mm. um yeah so it turns out that nobody was buying the bloody game literally nobody had copy of it uh it was reported to various people actually but i can't find an evidence of it so i will try and track it down for another video but yeah so of all the shops that there were mm -hmm. they had games on the shelves mm -hmm. and like you know people come in they pick them up they look at them that's how it used to be i haven't yeah. done that in a long time Actually, I buy all my games digitally now, which I fucking detest having to do. But there's so few game shops in the Philippines. Mm. Um, but, you know, you, you go in, you have a look. And I suppose people probably did do that. But then they put them right back down on the shelves. Yeah. And didn't buy them. Oh. Yeah. I know Chest. that is a fucking catastrophe. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. What's feeding the fire? It's unknown nine. That's that's you're singing two different songs. You're singing when you wish upon a star, but with the lyrics of the Christmas song. Ah, eh, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, there you go.